Oh, the light is messed up. Okay, I need to plug the light in. So, I'm sorry. Let me plug the light in real quick. I know the light was going to be like that. Um, How do I do this right now? Because, oh. Uh, so, the light is already plugged in. So, what do I do? Sorry. Oh, wait one second. I'm going to put it on pause. Hey, y'all. So. No, don't start. Don't do that. Cut it out. Sorry, I'm a cat. So, y'all, I finally got my light. I need to start using this light, y'all. Look what I'm using. That's what you really did by now. People think that you got to do extravaganza stuff for YouTube to make good YouTube videos. But you don't have to. Like, y'all, y'all don't believe what light. Y'all probably think I'm using a camera light. Right? Well, y'all see that light in the background. Well, y'all see the, the main fan light. Um, But, y'all, do y'all see what my face is so bright right now? It's not because of that light. If you were guessing that light, you're wrong. It's because of this. And y'all probably think it's a camera light that's making my face that bright, but it's not. Sorry, guys. I got a lot of stuff plugged up right now. Okay, I had, a lot, I had my cords was intertwined with each other. Right now, y'all, I am uh, trapping. Not literally, y'all. Not literally. I'm basically recording off my old Android phone because my iPhone uh, doesn't have any more storage. I couldn't even know Snapchat, y'all. I was so mad. But I'm just gonna have to wait till I get a new phone next month. Um, it's only one. It's only y'all. Y'all know it is so crazy how close we are to 2020, y'all. It just amazes me, yo. Like for real. But anyway, I'm using this light right here, y'all. This light right here. Oh my gosh! I might need my uh, little pocket uh thing for my Android phone because it's not standing up right. I know why. I think. No. You know what? We're going to ignore that. So, right now, y'all, I'm using... Um, I'm so stressed out, y'all. This video is not going to have uh, intro or outro. It's not going to be... This video is not going to be edited at all, y'all. So, y'all are basically just seeing the raw me. Um, and my hair, is y'all as y'all see, is all the way out. Um, last time y'all saw me in the face-to-face -face video, I had my braids in. I took my braids out about mm, six days ago. I don't know. Probably like a week now. It's what that's how long I had my braids out. And my hair needs washed, y'all. I haven't washed my hair. I know that's bad for you to leave your hair out after you um get take your braid out. You're supposed to wash it. Because braids when you have braids in and don't you're not obviously not combing your hair out every day because you have braids, right? So um What am I trying to say? When you don't comb your hair out every day, a lot of stuff happens. Um, you get tang, you get uh, knots. Um, your hair gets tangled up. Uh, not in braids though, but this is just what happens, y'all. Uh, and then b braids with braids in, you get dandruff, dandruff and dirt piles up in your hair. Um. And don't say ew. If you're one of those people who don't like seeing dandruff, please X out this video. Because obviously, you live in some false reality world. And I want to know where you live at, honey. Um, <laughs> because I want to know where you live at where you don't have dandruff. But anyway, uh, I have a scarf. I have all my stuff I need, I think. Hopefully, I have a little mirror just in case. Even though it's dirty as heck, I haven't used this mirror since I don't know when. Since I live in my old house. So... Huh, there's a lot of mess going on. This this video is gonna be real messy, y'all. Um, I'm talking about hair. One thing I do want to talk about. I'm talking about hair in this video. Well, I mean, one thing I do want to say. I'm talking about hair in this video. This is a hair video, and I might talk about a little celebrity gossip, but that's it. Um, I will leave uh timestamps below that are important. Um, if I talk about anything important, I will leave timestamps below so I can skip through if y'all like watching the whole watching the whole videos because it's gonna be. I don't know how long this video is gonna be, y'all. Well, actually. I'm going to have to make a couple parts of this video because as I'm looking at my my uh, phone, I only have 12 minutes. So, we're going to just get right into the, to the dental scratching uh, and talking about hair. And then, we'll talk about uh, the celebrity new, little news story later. Well, really, it's not big, y'all. I'll just say right now, um, Jada and her boyfriend, little baby, um... Je they, yesterday, the video of them went viral. She was grinding on him in the club, which I want to speak about that. I 
I'm just gonna be real. Don't come at me. Well, I don't care if y'all come at me. Jada, that woman, that woman, she's not a little child. Okay, this is not no kid relationship. They're both grown. Uh, Jada is a disgrace. I'm just gonna be real. Jada, whatever her name is, whatever her last name is, Jada and uh, little baby, that their relationship is a disgrace. Um, I'm just gonna say that for what it is. Because this is why it's a disgrace. This is why it's a disgrace, y'all. The reason why... Let me put this up here. Because I'm going to need it for my... for my uh. This is why it is a disgrace. It is a disgrace. Because... He cheats on her numerous times. Okay? And... What I don't like is... Okay, if you one of them girls, I don't judge. If you one of them girls who you don't mind when your man cheats on you, you keep on going back, that's fine with me. That's y'all business. But when you start going off on people, like, oh, da da da. Like, she was going off on people. She was going off on fans that were saying, you're dumb, sis. You look stupid. You can't go off on them. You do look stupid. Y'all, your relationship is a disgrace. Okay? And that's just on period. And that's all I got to say about them because they're making me mad. But anyway... Um, and it's not little baby's fault. Of course they're going to keep going, going back with her. You don't have no respect for yourself, Jada. Of course they're going to keep going back with you. Anyway, so I have two combs, no oil. I'm not doing, no putting no oil on my hair. I'm going to wash it, so there's no point putting oil on it. Matter of fact, I need to get this um light this light a little far away from me because I was about to, my eyes gonna burn off and that would have been horrible. Matter of fact, this is going all the way over here. Really it needs to let me move that. It needs to go right here. So I can see what I'm working with. Oh my hair keeps on getting caught in my nails. I need to part my hair, but I'm not really gonna be doing that. I'm going to focus on a couple parts. I'm not doing the back of my hair. I wish I had more time because I feel like I really don't feel like record, uh, starting a new part. But anyway. Let me see what I'm working with. Oh. I need one of those things. Let me unplug that for a second. Actually, I need that because y'all can't see me now. <laughs> well then, sorry guys. So I have two combs because one's for me, my actual comb in my hair because I'm gonna be doing a little bit of combing. Oh, we already have knots coming out. Y'all see that? That's a disgrace. My hair is a disgrace. I'm over talking about. These uh, these are couples, my hair's a disgrace. Um, anyway, we're gonna focus on this part right now. Um, and we're gonna be talking about people's opinions of me. Um, and we're just gonna be talking about my opinion. This is gonna be a different video, y'all. I'm gonna be y'all actually gonna be saying a different um y'all because I've been doing just I I haven't really been uh doing any videos about me lately because. I've been so worried about celebrity gossip, getting all these celebrity stories out. Um, I haven't really been doing no videos about me. There is dirt in this comb. But hey, I'm not worried about it. Um, you need two combs when you're when you're coming out your hair, I think. One big comb and one little comb because the little combs are for the dancer of pieces. That I'm gonna pull out, but anyway, so my number one, this is gonna be like a kind of a popular opinion video. So I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put some of my popular opinion, um, my popular opinions in this video. So my one popular opinion is is that school America um, schools in America are trash. The schooling in America is trash. I don't care. The public schools are trash in America. They really are. Like. I'm not sending my kids, when I have kids, I'm not sending my kids to no public schools. You're being homeschooled. And I don't care if you like it or not, you're getting homeschooled. Like, no. My kids are not going to go through what I've seen my family go through and what I have went through. Like, y'all don't even know. 
I do know that I'm going to burn my face off with this light. That's what I do know. Sorry if I'm not looking at the camera. I'm not going to be really looking at the camera all the time. Because I, I told you I'm using my iPhone for my camera. I mean, I, uh, my mind. <laughs> I'm using my iPhone for my mirror and my Android for my camera to record it off. So, that's that. Oh my god, I see the flakes just popping out. Uh, I'm going to start loose up in this video. <laughs> like, my hair is just too tangled to even come through. Never do this, guys. Kids, don't do this. Make sure you comb your hair out. Especially if you take out braids. Don't ever do this. What I'm doing right now. I'm going through it. Let's try to use a big comb because the little comb's not ha having it. I normally just use my nails because my nails work the best. Because I have long nails and my nails are acting like a comb, but. Oh. I need a thing that goes to my hair. Matter of fact, I'm gonna just use where I put my scrunchie for my hair, my hair tie. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put some in my hair bag. Because this is not gonna work. Ignore my armpit hair. I know, I know, I know. I do not care. Watch y'all. This is a real video. This is not no celebrity gossip video. Um, this is a video of me. The blame ain't the best, but I don't care. That's not what I'm aiming for. Now, I can finally get to my hair. I mean, to the... The... Scalp. <sighs> okay, y'all. So, I deleted a few big apps on the Android that I still had. I don't even know why I still have apps on this phone, to be honest, but, um, so the least come with my big ass, and now I have 22 minutes. So, we're gonna try to, this is probably, I'm, I'm gonna be able to do this. After this part, I'm not doing any more parts, so, and we're not doing the whole head. We're not scratching the whole head. It's gonna be some little, like, all this is what I'm scratching today. So... Oh lord. Where's the big comb at? I'm gonna put the camera, I mean, the mirror down here. So y'all can see it too. I want y'all to see this action too. So, what should we talk about while I'm doing this? I want to talk about how why I feel that way about America, uh, America, America's public schools. Cause y'all might be wondering why I feel that way. Y'all might be saying right now that's so disrespectful. It's really not though. Uh oh. Let's see what's going on right there. Cause I see the most flakes coming from right here. The reason why y'all I'm not doing my full head is cause I don't have a lot of danger for my head. It is way more though than usual because I had a brazen, like I said. Uh oh, we're all right here. I really need to. Let me pour it. Yeah.
y'all just don't mind my parts I don't really care I'm making sure y'all can see this too I can't zoom in so alright that's much better okay now y'all can see the action I'm seeing Actually, I'm gonna be real. The Andro Android camera quality is way better than the iPhone. That's another pop unpopular opinion. Psst. Yeah, I'm sorry that this video is all over the place, but. It is what it is. So, as y'all can see, I'm going to show y'all all the danger if that fell on the phone. Barely none. So, um, I think I'm just going to come in here all now. Matter of fact, I really need, I don't know why I didn't get it before I started the video, but I really need one of those things that holds your hair back because I have so much hair in it all. Mm -mm. But let me talk about something. I'm talking about my hair and how I overcame my insecurity of my hair. I used to have a big insecurity about my hair, texture, type, whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm still dealing with insecurity a little bit. I'm just overcoming it as I get older. And I really think it's from me being, me going to public school. I used to go to public school. And I went to public school basically my whole life, I want to say. Until fifth grade is when I stopped going to public school. But I remember this one time, y'all. This one year, we had picture day at school. You know, y'all know picture day. Um, we had picture day for school. And we all lined up. I had a lot of friends. And this is third grade. I had a lot of friends. Um, this is before I started getting picked on. Um, this was the year before I started getting picked on. I went to, I'm just going to say the school. I went to Reed Creek Elementary in Charlotte, North Carolina. And I hate that school to the, to, still to this day. I really do. It wasn't the most, y'all, it wasn't horrible with, like, I don't want to say it was horrible with the kids. The kids were good kids, actually. Um, but... It's just like, I hate it for my own reasons. And I've had a few of those people from fourth grade who try to come back later. They would see me on like social media and they come back and be like, is this Kennedy from fourth grade? And I would know, I would, rem I would go on their page and be like, oh, who's this? And I would remember all this they said about, that's why you gotta be careful what you say to people. Because I remember me going on their page and being like, 
Oh, this is that B. They used to tuck, say this and this and this about me. Mm-mm. Try to come back and be my friend now, because we don't even... No, I'm not with that. Not, I'm not with that fake stuff. Mm-mm. Because when we, when we would see each other every day, we weren't friends. So we're not friends now. No. And that's just the truth. Um, but yeah, y'all. But I'm gonna tell y'all about third grade. This one I had a lot of friends. Um, I actually miss my friends from third grade. Y'all are real as the F. Like, I miss y'all so much. That's before school got bad. That's before school. That was my last good year of school, y'all. What year was that? 2013, 2014? That was my last good year of school. After that... Well, I won't say that. I'll say the beginning of fourth grade, too. 2013 to 2015 were the last good years I had at school. Because I met my... I met, like, my... She's my road dog. Like, that girl was my home dog. Like, for real. My ride or die. Like, Sontier, shout out to you, bruh. Like, if I saw that girl today... I would just give her a big hug. Like, that was my girl. When nobody else was there for me, you were there for me. Well, like, straight up. That's why I always say, get you some real friends. If it's only one or two, that's all you need. I only have one good friend right now, y'all. I don't have a lot of friends. My mom said that. My mom's like, Kennedy, you're so pretty. When you're pretty, you don't have a lot of friends. That's the sad life of being pretty. But that's what it is. Beauty is pain, y'all. In all ways. But I'm going to explain the situation that happened to me in third grade. I had a lot of friends. But this happened in fourth grade, too. This happened in fourth grade a lot more than third grade. But when I was in third grade, I had, I had Fisher Bay. My mom flattened my hair the night before. Now, my mom isn't the best. She's not like, I would say, I don't want to say this being mean, but Dominicans do the best hair. I don't want to offend anybody by saying that, but that's just the truth. They do the best flattening of hair and blowouts. Um, That's just the truth of the matter, um, period, point blank. I don't care if anybody has a problem with that. Um, But anyway, so my mom flattened my hair the night before. My mom does a, Alright, y'all be flattening here. It's good, but it gets frizzy the next day. Like, so the next day for picture day, um, I was running around my friends, with my gang. We called it. We we were a gang, but not really a gang. We weren't part of all that violent stuff. But if you step to one of us, you step to all of us. That's how we were. We're all going to fight you. We're going to jump on you. And it was boys, too. It was, like, girls and boys. I'm more cool with boys, y'all, than girls. Now, today, I'm more cool with boys than girls. Back then, I was more cool with the girls in the gang than the boys. And me and this one boy that were in the gang went out. Two of the boys. Kind of. No. We actually, no. I run to how it went. Me and the other boys started dating. Going out. Whatever. That's not even... I don't even count those as real relationships, though, because mm -mm, only one of them I do, but no, I don't count the other one as an ex because he was like, I only get, we were with him to get back at my friend who was trying to go out with my boyfriend. If y'all, it was just, it got real messy, y'all. That's why I don't deal with girls now, because girls are so petty, and I just don't deal with it. Nope. Um, but... In third grade, I told y'all my mom flattened my hair the night before. Before this is picture day, and my mom flattened my hair the night before. And the next day, I was hanging out with my friends. We was running around. My hair got frizzy, and before before I, I like I was able to take my pictures. I just spit. But by the time I went there to take my, you know, y'all stand that line. Y'all all go up one by one and take your pictures. So I took my picture, and it was my hair was so frizzy, and I remember. I would hear little people talk about me like after when I went there to take my picture they was like her hair is just like so poofy and da -da 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 -da. and I'm gonna tell you about another situation that happened when I was at camp this one girl 
I don't want to say no names because I'm still friends with the one girl. Um, well, I really shouldn't even bring that up, but she said this. This is what she said to me. She was like, um, my hair was a mess this day, y'all. It was a mess. Um, and she was like, we were in a bathroom and we was doing my hair. And she was like, who gave you this hair? Your mom or your dad? Because, mm. And I was like, my dad? Like, but people who say stuff like that, y'all, this is what y'all gotta realize. If anybody ever talks about you, y'all need to really, by all means, just ignore them. Because that means that, that shows a lot of, that shows that they have a lot of insecurities about themselves. Um, and that's why I realized that I don't give a F what people say. Moral story. But I'm, I'm, a lot of things that people have said about me, more stories, people are effed up in this world, and if you don't say, have that I don't give a F what people have to say about me attitude, you're kind of screwed. You're going to be really screwed, mentally screwed in the head, and that's the truth of the matter. That's all I can really say about it. Leave me some. In the comments, y'all, leave me some uh, good old shows to watch. Like old 2000 shows. I'm, I'm, I've been re-watching a lot of old 2000 shows. And I love them. They're like so lit. It just reminds me of the old days. Like, I don't know. TV's kind of butt now. You gotta watch like Netflix to really get the good shows, or like, I don't know. You gotta watch like, uh, it's just like mm, TV's butt. But TV in the back in the day, early two thousands, mid two thousands, used to be lit. I like, I can't even really. It's like some of the old Disney shows, I can't even watch because they make me cry. Like, it just makes me relive my childhood. Like some episodes I watch, and I'm like, I know exactly where I was at this moment. Like, it just makes me think back. You see that? When you comb your hair, y'all, y'all cannot be afraid if hair comes out. Because that's going to happen. Like, especially if you, have, if you don't comb your hair every day, hair's going to come out. Like... Oh, another thing I want to talk about y'all in this video for the last couple minutes. Cause I only got a couple more minutes before the, this video is going to end. But Instagram, y'all, don't all these all social media period, but Instagram especially is a false reality, and that's why I had to realize over the years too. Bad junk is a false reality, and that's just true. And y'all, if y'all know what I mean by that, then mm, y'all part of part. Y'all probably, if y'all know what I mean by that, y'all probably are a part of the false reality of Instagram. It's just a false reality. It makes you believe. It makes people believe that that person, like, y'all could, okay, for instance, I'm going to give an example. Y'all could sit there. What is that? Oh, that's thing that's here. Y'all could sit there and watch... A, per a person's Instagram feed all day. Especially girls. Um, I'm going to give an example. Megan Thee Stallion. You sit there and watch her Instagram feed all day. If you're a girl, you're going to be like, dang, I wish I had her money. I wish I had her looks. I wish I had her body, her butt, her boobs. But really, number one, little do you know, you don't want that. <laughs> Period. You don't want that. You got to be happy with yourself. And if you're not happy with who you are, don't go on Instagram. Shut up. Because it's going to make you think you, it's going to make you want to be something you're not. It's why all these girls get these fake boobs, fake buds, because 
they want to be Megan Thee Stallion, Nicki Minaj, Cardi B. But do you really? Uh, Believe it or not, y'all, this is the best way to get out your dandruff. Just come in your hair. It's all dandruff just falls out. I was going to try to just do it, do my, uh. Oh, my. The back is horrible. Alright, that's all I'm gonna do for this video. Or I need to do more. Never mind, I need to do more. There's one part I missed. It's right here. And that's all I'm gonna do. Ooh, this part's bad. Oh my. Alright, this here is ready to be washed. Now I'm gonna do is where's my where's my spongy? Am I sitting on it again? Oh no, it's right here. Okay. Well, let I me. Mean, sorry, y'all. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to put the scarf around it, but it might be a little. This is a little too big. I mean, my effort's a little too big to be putting. Let me hurry up. I should have untied that before the video. That's not gonna work, guys. I'm gonna put my hair back first in a bun. Again, ignore the underarm hair. I did. I did not. I haven't shaved my underarms in a while. Because y'all, I've been stressed lately, so. Mm. Then I'm gonna do is then I'm gonna take it back out. Where's the thing? At? I don't know what I'm doing, y'all. I really don't. <sighs> well, y'all, <laughs> that's the end of this video. Um, I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna do with my video. I mean, I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna do with my hair. But until right now, but yeah. So, it's in my video. I'm um, sorry that if it, if it was real clustered, um, yeah, deuces.